Hey there everybody, it's been a while since I've been back on here, so uh, give you an update. I just took a trip up about an hour north of me, picked up some more stuff. Got off the ship a few days ago and been working on cleaning and organizing the shop just so I could bring these pieces in. So I'll get you turned around and show you what's going on. Yeah, here's the shop. Not nearly as clean as I'd like it to be currently, but or at least for what I'm bringing in here, this entire area over here is going to be completely reorganized. Just picked up, a, like I said, picked up a couple of things about an hour north of me. And about to bring them in. My brother's bringing the backhoe down so we can lift. So I'll show you. going these two pieces right here are what I'd picked up three foot by five foot rock of ages surface plate 10 inches thick granite 10 inch Kurt vice and a pantograph Decal GK21, I believe the number is. So we'll work on getting these things unloaded. It occurs to me that when I started the video there, I failed to mention probably the most noteworthy piece on the trailer. This is a Hill Acme shop crane, 1940s era. Not the cast iron, the uh, fabricated steel variety, a little newer than maybe I'd like, but it is a massive piece. Big restoration project it is 12 foot 6 inches tall from the bottom of the wheels to the top of the nose up there. Fair bit of repair work, a lot of de-rusting to do, but that is what that is. Turning back in, we've got everything unloaded. Like I said, it's a Rock of Ages surface plate. Three foot by five foot, 10 inches thick. Manufactured in 1979. I don't know what grade it currently is, but it'll do for anything I need to do for now. The Deckel Pantograph. GK21, like I said earlier. It should be operational condition. Fair bit of cleanup, but that's about all I'll probably do with that. There is the big Kurt Vice, and those are parts for the decal. Handle for the Kurt, bridge port, boring head, another little indexing table. as well as a rotary indexing head there that is a lw chuck company unit a lot of cleanup like everything else i pick up and as then we got lock rings all sort of old lock rings and a surface grinder finish comparison kit. So we've got the different finishes that could be attained that you might, that a customer might want. For me, this is more just a novelty shelf piece but those are the picks for the day the bridge crane was a previous pick but the buddy I took with me to pick these other things up had brought that home for me oh, a couple weeks ago while I was still gone and I took him with for this pick and we loaded it on after we had ever got back so 
now I'll get around to rearranging this place more again and figure out the new homes for these because they are not sitting in the middle of everything. So that's the update for today. I will show you more when I get things rearranged again. If you like what you see, let me know. Otherwise, you know the routine. Click the like. If you want to, click the subscribe. I will see you all another day.